Hello everyone, Sick here. Today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on how to defeat Jega or Domini on Legendary. Out of all the entire Halo Infinite bosses, this one was the easiest for me. Why? All of my armor abilities were fully upgraded, which made this fight really easy, even on Legendary. So what you need to do is switch between a Threat Detector and your Thruster. Thankfully, his sword doesn't kill you in one slash, so even if he does hit you, you can just Thruster away, run away, grapple away, etc. The Threat Detector helps you for when he fades away, you can find him again really easily. There are also assault rifles located in the room, so if you need to go pick up another weapon, that's a good weapon I'd suggest picking up. Jega Ardomni was by far the easiest boss, and it only took me two attempts to complete on Legendary. If you guys need help, feel free to leave a comment down below, and I'll do my best to help you out. The reason why it was so easy for me is because simply his hit or his attack doesn't kill you right off the bat. A lot of the Brute Chieftains, they have a one-hit hammer swing that will kill you instantly, whereas Jega Ardomni, even if he hits you, it doesn't kill you immediately. 